Hey you guys, I'm back. I know it's been a minute. It's always been a minute. Um, but I'm back uh, mainly because, and y'all check out the hair, the hair, the hair. I don't, it ain't, you can't see the full extent of his glory, but I'm just coming from work. I had to tie it up, you know, I work in healthcare. I ain't, I ain't taking no chances, but it actually looks pretty good down. Anyway, at least it's done, right? It ain't no scarf or no damn hat this time. Anyway, um, so I just found out this morning that Tiny Lister died. And if you don't know who he is, he played Debo. That's what he's most known for, at least in the black community, is Debo on Friday. And, I mean, I know he's not as huge as a Chadwick Boseman or um, a Sean Connery who just recently passed or a Pat Sajak. Or, but in black homes, especially during that time, like, he's he, like, Debo. It's Debo. Hell, we even coined a phrase out of it. I still use to this day. That just goes to show my age. Because back when I was growing up to say you Debo, somebody was popular. I still say it to this day. I know old people, they be looking at me like, I mean, young people looking at me, what she say, Debo? Yeah, I still say like, damn, she Debo, Joe shit. You know, I still, that's how iconic it is. It became part of the vernacular. You know, so it, it, like I said, he may not have that world popularity or whatever but to us to the black community like he was everything and i hate to say i can't even remember anything else he's played in um i know the fifth element he was in that um lord i know that sounds bad but i mean but he's debo man like come on 2020 i think really the only bright spot to 2020 i ain't gonna say only because there's always more than one bright spot but i think one of the few bright spots of 2020, because I ain't talked about this yet, y'all. I ain't talked about the, the the 45 and he pulling, he refusing to leave and he's still saying three weeks, four weeks later, however long it's been, it, it, they need a recount. It's like, it seemed like the longest damn election in fucking history. But hey, we got a new president and a woman of color. In the White House. So, I don't know. Did I do a video about that? I don't child. I don't know. It's been so crazy. And it's so long since I posted the video. I keep looking that way because my cat's in a damn Christmas tree. And I'm recording so I can't get them out. But anyway. Um. Whatever. <laughs> I don't even know when last time I posted, y'all. I ain't look. But I just, I just felt compelled to, like, make a video about that. Because it's just, like, or vlog, whatever the hell we call it. Y'all call it. it. Ain't what I call it. But anyway. It's just... Man, like 2020, oh, this is going to be a year that none of us is ever going to forget forever. Like, it's just been, it's just, we're tired. Oh, I'm sorry. Tad, see, tired. Okay, let me stop doing that. I was hitting my arm for emphasis. You know, y'all can't see it, but I talk with my hands in case y'all ain't noticed by now. Um, I don't even know what to say. Like, it's like I'm hurt. I'm really hurt. But at the same time, it's like, damn, for real? another one? Like, what else? What else? This how we going to end the year? First, we start the year off with Kobe. We ended with Debo. Like, too iconic. Like, come on, man. And then it's like, on one hand, I'm so ready for this year to be over with because it's been so difficult on I don't know how many levels, just mentally, spiritually, emotionally, physically at times, just hard draining exhausting so on one hand i'm ready for it to be over with and on the other hand it's like hell if it's, this was this bad i'm scared to see what the hell 2021 gonna do shit how she gonna pop off because 2020 been straight ignorant just off the chain just do whatever the fuck like just gonna fuck you up and all kind mm. we just we battle weary y'all that's what i call it we is 2020 battle weary I don't even know what else to say. This is going to be a short one because I'm just so thrown by that. It's like, well, this is so, just when we think things might be evening out, I'm just going to throw that in there. Like, bam. And I should have a lot to talk about because I, I, ain't, I ain't talk about, I ain't talked to y'all in a while. So, but I really don't. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. And I really ain't been in the mood to post for y'all who care. My one or two little subscribers. If I even still have y'all. Um, I've just been tired, y'all. Working and just 
here mentally. Like I know I ain't doing nothing but talking to a camera, but I still have to be in a certain space, headspace to kind of want to do it. You know what I'm saying? And I just ain't been there and I ain't got no other excuse. I just ain't been in a headspace to want to do it. But this one just, it, I think it was just a representation of how fucked up this year has been. It's just to lose him of all people. Like, hmm. Mm -mm. prayers to his family, prayers to his family. <sighs> mm -mm -mm. Mm. I'm trying to, as I'm sitting here, I'm trying to think of what the hell I'm next I'm going to talk about. I'm just going to make this a five minute video. I think I'm just going to stick with a five minute video. Cause I don't really know what else to say at this point. I'm just tired. And it's too much stuff that I'm like, what have I talked about? What haven't I talked about? It's just, it's too much. And I'm just, I ain't in a mood. But I did want to acknowledge that. And anybody want a cat? I can't get rid of them though. The child is too attached. Ugh. Anyway, sorry y'all. Y'all don't care about my cat. All right, I'm rambling. So I'm about to go. Um, I'm gonna tell you as always. I didn't even go tell y'all to hit like, subscribe, no more, cause I feel like a fraud at this point. Cause I ain't, I ain't posted that now to how long. All right, but if y'all so want to, please do. I would appreciate it. Until next time, let's talk.